uh, an issue that's particularly uh, applicable to Southwest Virginia. We have had black lung benefits in existence for a long time. But unfortunately, and this is a, a story that uh, I've been working on for a couple of years, um, widows of minors who have died from black lung are many, many times finding it very difficult to um, get their benefits. So what we have put in place is legislation, Tim Kaine and a variety of us, we've introduced it a couple times, would change the presumption uh, to presume if you hit certain indices uh, that a minor died from black lung so that again, that widow could get the benefits that frankly she's deserved. And unfortunately, uh, we're seeing a, a dramatic uptick in black lung amongst much younger minors. So this is not a, simply a problem looking back retroactively um, to many of our mine workers as the number of mines have gone down. It is a current problem as well, unfortunately, as we've seen the, the incidence of black lung go up. So I really hope this is, this is not going to cost a lot of money. It basically guarantees widows uh, their benefits uh, that they have earned. Their, their oftentimes husbands who are minors, you know, in a sense, gave their life because they got black lung in helping to power our country. It is, I think, our obligation to honor those commitments. And we need to, uh, frankly, get rid of a lot of the legal and hurdles that some of the insurance companies are putting in place to, to stop these individuals from, from getting this benefit they deserve. We've got that legislation as well going forward.